SpaceX has created reusable rocket launch systems, sent a car into space, launched satellites into orbit, and now a partnership with NASA means it's the first private company to take humans into orbit and to the International Space Station. It's achieved a lot since it began in 2002, but its ultimate goal is to get humans living on other planets. SpaceX is the brainchild of this guy, Elon Musk. It's important that we become a space faring civilization and, and I'll be out there among the stars. You know, we want the things that are in science fiction novels and movies not to be science fiction forever. We want them to be real one day. He helped found the company that became PayPal. He then founded Tesla and is supposedly the inspiration for Robert Downey Jr.'s version of Tony Stark, aka Iron Man, in the Marvel films. This is, this is Matt. He's known for speaking his mind and more recently for giving his child a rather unusual name. I'm not going to try to pronounce that. There's a lot of talk about SpaceX's Falcon 9 rocket and Crew Dragon capsule, and now they're being used to take American astronauts back into orbit. This launch from the Kennedy Space Center in Florida on the 27th of May 2020, with two astronauts on board, is the first crewed mission since 2011, when NASA finally retired its space shuttle fleet. And because of the coronavirus pandemic, extra measures are being taken to ensure no deadly viruses end up in space. We have been in quarantine probably longer than any other space uh, space crew has ever been in the history of the space program. Reusable equipment is a big USP for SpaceX. Space exploration is cheaper if you can reuse rockets again and again. This mission follows years of testing, and tests didn't always go well. meaning things have been delayed by nearly four years. A lot of people ask how much money the company makes. It's hard to say because it's a private one and it doesn't have to share its books with us. But we do know the Crew Dragon mission is saving NASA a lot of money. Some say as much as $40 billion.